Hey, what is up everybody? It's Dimo here. So, in today's video, we're gonna be playing on a fighter. On a fighter with a long sword. I'm a rogue main and basically I had to let everybody know. Long sword fighter, rogue main, perfect combination. So, basically, first thing first, let's go over the perks and skills that we're gonna be playing with. When you start a new character, you get uh, defense mastery as your main perk, as well as sprint and second win. You wanna keep these perks because they're best, they're absolutely beautiful as well also. There is one thing we have recently received is the new perk, I mean skill, which is Spell Reflection. It basically reflects projectiles, but I'm not sure if it's really good, so we might as well test that out some at some point. But as for now, we're just gonna go play on a fighter with Longsword. I really like Longsword, I think it's really OP, and we're gonna keep everything as is. First thing first, we're gonna go to the Squire, Mr. Squire, hello my friend. We're gonna take the Longsword. Here we go, we get the Longsword. Now we are actually kind of cooking. Then you wanna keep, um, take the um, Princess Cogs, make sure you have bandages, and... Um, make sure you have a campfire that's basically it you don't really need arming sword or any round shield i don't think i really need it it could be helpful but i don't really think i care enough to use this basically this is what we're going to be rocking with okay so when you start out you have literally zero resources everything is going to be empty and it's going to looking kind of sad we would have to change it we we'll have to hop in the game and we we'll have to go clap some cheeks we're going to start with absolutely zero and hopefully we will end up having a little zero to hero at the end of the day and basically, yeah, there's one thing that I forgot to mention is you get to pick every single task on a fighter. Basically, I mean, or just any other class when you create a character, just by pressing one button. Boom, you press it, everything is done. So yeah, we're gonna hop in the game, we're gonna go clap some cheeks on a fighter with a longsword. You get to choose um, the races, especially if you have any. Well, I'll very likely you don't have any, so we let's equip Lycan. I think it's pretty cool. Lycan with a longsword. I, I like the way it sounds, so yeah, we're gonna hop in the game, we're gonna clap some cheeks, and let's see how far we're gonna get with this build. Damn, the attack animation of this actually feels quite satisfying. It feels pretty good, I like it. Oh, you fuck. I was wondering, what the hell is this shit? Okay. Jeez. Hell yeah, brother. Okay, dude. Listen, does this Wahinder count as a longsword? I think it does. I think it's a sword and it's kind of long. So we might as well actually play with this Wahinder this game. <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna change this. But a uh, blue Zhuai compared to a longsword. It's a fucking day and night damage wise. Alright, yeah. Well, I mean. First game, <laughs> and I find a fucking blue longsword. Oh, that's bullshit, dude. But listen, this is a blue longsword, okay? I'm gonna change it. What the fuck are the homies doing? Is that a friendly lobby? No shit. Biss! Holy cow, dude, we're fucking cooking. God damn! Fuck, I kinda wanna dive in, you know, with that Y hander. <laughs> oh well, listen. If everyone's friendly, I don't wanna, you know, interfere, let the homies cook. That's fine. Some games just gonna be like that, you know what I mean? I used to fucking just go in and betray everybody. When it was a team in meta. I was like trying to do the, you know, countermeasures. But, um, we might as well do it. Okay, let me know, let me know if you're cool with it. Like, you know, if you'd want me to hop on the evil arc. But it's just, the thing is, right now with the matchmaking, if I betray a few people, People will think of me as a person who betrays everybody and it's not gonna be good because pretty much right now I play with the exact same three to 500 people every game, like legit. Same players, nothing ever changes. Like all the veteran players are in my lobbies and it's the same thing all over again. Oh, what the fuck is that? Ah, oh, that's the curse. Another friendly guy. Man, what the fuck is this dude? 
Bro, another friendly guy? How many of those there is, dude? Fuck. Everyone is big time chilling, holy cow. It's like, what, four fucking friendly people already? That's bullshit, dude. Ow. Oh wait, this guy's not friendly. What the fuck? Okay, that's good to know. I still have a second win, so it's not like I really do care too much about... But we get to use the longsword. <laughs> I mean, Dwyhander is technically longsword, you know what I mean? Oh, you bitch. I haven't played with a Zweihander in so fucking long. Gigi's. Alright, time to go use Shrine. I didn't use the second win. I didn't thought I needed it. I probably should have, actually. I don't have a campfire. I could have just reset my second win. It wasn't anything, you know, out of hand. But yeah, the homie was kind of cooking. Fucking crazy guy, jeez. Bro, the guy is still doing the troll? You fucking with me. That's crazy, dude. There's like five friendly people in this lobby. Nah, that's... Well, six including me. One guy that I killed. And that's basically the whole fucking lobby. Dude. That's insane. <laughs> Bro. It reminds me of days when, you know, people were AP grinding and no one was attacking each other. It was kind of hilarious. That's where I started my YouTube channel, by the way. Alright, first game was kind of weird, but at least we got one kill with the long sword, which, which is a Zwei Hunter. Homies are still fucking trying to kill a troll. <laughs> and yeah, we're gonna get into the next one. And, um, yeah. We got a little bit of cheese, we got something to work with. Hell yeah, brother. Alright. Oh, someone is here. The fuck, the homie got a cape? What the fuck is this lobby, bro? I'm fucking naked. That's good. Let's go fuck with this guy, I guess. Ah, bro, I fucking knew that would happen. Fuck. Alright, now it feels like something impossible to catch, you know, right now. At least with a long sword. Okay, maybe maybe we get too far and I could kill him. I did expect him to hit me. Oh fuck. <laughs> Holy fuck. Actually, it would end up better than I thought it would. Bro, I became a fucking parry bot, man. Nah, I understand how it feels. It's like, you want that feeling of a clink, clink. And then basically just parry and you cut those heads off, you know what I mean? With the parry. Yeah, and that fucking feels, feels really good. I, I actually... The thing is, I played with a longsword, but I played it as a meme completely without a right click at all. And I had decent time. But um, if you get that parry off, oh fuck, it feels so good. But yeah, it's not very effective though, 9 out of 10 times.
Oh yeah, the homie is not feeling it. I think it was a fucking headshot. If there's a dead end, I probably will be able to get him. Why did he decide to go left instead of right? <laughs> what? Just a little reminder, this is not a new fucking player. This is a guy who played this game for multiple hundreds and hundreds of hours. Probably sub thousand hours or some shit. Because this is just how the matchmaking works. Bro, there's gotta be players somewhere, like holy cow. I circle out through the whole map. Only two players early on. Looks like somebody killed both bosses and um, looted, you know, the gold pile in the trolls room. Cyclops? No, just, just cleaned out a little. Oh well, it is what it is, you know what, we might as well just go extract. I doubt we're gonna find a person who fucking killed both bosses. It's fine. Give me some biz, bro. Biz! Holy cow, look at that. Two green items. Bro, we fucking cook. Oh, fuck. Ah, you piece of shit. <laughs> Okay. Bro, I wish I had a fucking trial bow or something. No, I gotta fix this. I gotta get a trial bow next game. You bitch. Bro, bats are the biggest fucking challenge, legit. I feel like they have infinite amount of HP. Takes forever to kill. We have a guy here. Oh, bro, that... No shit, that's the same guy? Sorry, I lost him, what the fuck? You fucking with me. Oh god. Jesus Christ, dude, what the fuck is this shit, dude? How could I miss? The longsword has a fucking higher reach. Dude. <laughs> fuck, man. I don't like this. This guy probably is super fucking geared. Oh, yeah, holy fuck. This guy is cracked, dude. This guy is crazy. Holy shit. Nah, dude, that's crazy, bro. So much meds. Nah, the homie is insane, bro. Now we have a bow. Who could actually fucking cook? I could almost guarantee he have fucking drops here. I don't like this game. Why the fuck am I not playing on a ranger, dude? I wish I had a survival bow. I fucking hate the lone bow, dude. It's like low action and you legit can't fucking physically play this game. I legit don't even know what do I hate more, druids or fucking rangers. It's like one class is complete radius class, the other one gives you fucking 
a guarantee ability to kill people. Biggest file of dog shit. Fuck. He died. He just fucking died. Holy shit, dude. Fucking one ranger down, bro. Makes me fucking happy. Imagine fucking... Nah. Like, playing on a ranger is like legit. You just fucking get a whatever kit. Can buy traps or lead people to traps. Get free kills. Fucking nah, dude. Ranger class is legit fucking cancer. Not just ranger. The whole range meta is cancer. It's like basically rangers and druids, it's what's wrong with this game right now. I'm not even tripping. Yeah, that was kind of fast. I feel like it would be pretty hard to make content with the longsword, consider how quick the fight could end if you land that parry. I just like... <laughs> what is gonna be the lead up to all of this? You just parry once, insta-kill a person, and it's fucking Joe Overgo next. It's like legit, you could put 30 minutes video in like fucking 2 minutes clip if you're a longsword player. Damn, it's gonna be a rough one. <laughs> but yeah, probably this was the perfect representation of what Longsword could do. Fucking 200 health, Barb got erased into his. I wonder how many levels we're gonna get. I think we're gonna be at level 14 right after. We'll see though. Let's check. Fuck, dude. Almost level 15. Fuck, bro. It's fine, it's fine. Oh, I have a quest. Nice. Beautiful reward. 10 out of 10. Hold on a minute, I'm level 15 by the way. Oh shit, I'm level 15 bro. Hell yeah brother, that's what I'm talking about. Calculated. Absolutely calculated. Nah, I knew I'd be hit level 15. Alright, we're looking pretty good. Let's get into the next game. Level 15? Not bad. By the way, did you guys know you could actually use the fucking map? That's huge in my opinion. That's actually pretty cool. I didn't know that. Someone is definitely here, bro. Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> Does he not see me? There's no way. Jeez, bro. Feels so fucking evil. <laughs> Listen, that's the power of a longsword right here. No other weapon could have done better than this. Homies best out, by the way. Full green best. It's crazy, dude. People are really around gear like this. Bro. 
Man, I won this fight, but uh, I feel like I was the one who got owned. Like, what are this fucking... <laughs> fucking movement dude, was crazy. Alright, not a bad game. Wow, dude, I don't think I could kill this guy. That's a full play Trondle guy. Mm, I need fucking assistance. Maybe I get someone to kill him. Maybe that could work. Oh, hell no. That's not good. I don't think I have a single fucking door open here. Oh. Yeah. Oh, the home decided to fuck off. Well, good enough. What the fuck? Dude, that's the same fucking guy, bro. You fucking with me. I don't have emotes. <laughs> no. <laughs> what am I fucking supposed to do here, bro? Unforge. I gotta lead this guy into a fucking a Withered or a Warlock or some shit. Oh, you fucking with me. Oh, there's a guy. Oh shit, there's a guy. This might be my chance. Okay, so we have a barb. I let the barb kill the fighter. <laughs> I'm the, I'm trying to fucking deal with the barb resident with the fighter. I'm not sure if this guy has stand a chance against the fighter though. Like, what are his chances? It's like two naked people versus one giga chat. Plus teaming is kind of cringe. So yeah, I'll just let the barb deal with this guy. I'll deal with the barb later. That's not good. Should have closed the door, I think, but I don't want to get hit. Dude! Oh shit. Barb is on my side, dude. Oh, fuck. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I get to reset my stuff. Barb, please kill him. Nah. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Wait, 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 wait. The Barb is actually a fucking cooker or something. Is he? He is, bro. Look at him. Oh shit! I wanna see this, I wanna fucking see this. Kill him! Oh fuck, I think I hit the barb. No. I gotta witness this. I'll have to fight whoever wins though right after. But actually, if a barb wins, I let him reset. The barb has won. No shit, dude! The barb has won! How? Oh, we have another guy. Let's go fight this guy, I guess. I gotta fight that barb right after. I wanna, I wanna duel this barb down bed. I 
I wonder if that fighter was geared or not. I think he was very geared. Let's fight, brother. You down to a fight? You down? You cool to a fight? I need a campfire and then we could fight. You cool with it? Brother, you cool with it or no? <laughs> Just say something. I don't think he want to fight me. But, um, without him I would have died. Interesting. He gave me something. Holy fuck! <laughs> fight me, brother! Kill me! We gotta fight! Alright. No, I just didn't want to take it from him, though. <laughs> I could have, but um, now that he have a fucking full set, I think it's okay for me to just try and uh, chase him. Fuck, he's gonna extract. No, dude. I gotta let him hit me once or something. Nice. Oh my god, dude! Oh, fuck, what have I done? <laughs> Bro, people- oh, shit! Yo, people who are saying that the longsword is not good. The fuck are you guys smoking? I don't think there is a single weapon that uh, has as much um, burst damage as the parry from the longsword. The homie got fucking erased from existence. And based on his gear, I could tell he has um, probably around 180 health or something. Homie was cooking. Wow, a full kit with armor and health? Holy, holy cow, dude. That's kind of naughty. We legit got a full fucking kit out of this. Alright, so what is the very first thing you do when you get a good kit? You equip it and you go test it out in action, you know what I mean. <laughs> Listen, we got it for free pretty much. And um, even if we lose it, it's okay, because we earned it with iron. My past self probably would have instantly sold it on market, but uh, now I'm just gonna fucking equip it and go have fun with it, you know what I mean? Okay. Bitch. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, by the way, I figured why does your magic protection pod instantly gets removed? The reason is actually because of the damage output. The damage is equivalent to... Um, basically, the Curse of Pain does so much damage that it just instantly removes protection pod. And then you just get, get hit by dots. So, which is kind of reasonable. So it's not really a glitch, I think. It's just the amount of damage it does. Alright, let's go mid to see if there's anyone here. Holy fuck, homie was not dying, dude. Thank you, bastard. He also did position himself pretty well. Fighting him is kind of risky. Phew. 
Oh, it's kind of close. Oh shit, the homie killed somebody. God damn. Homie was cooking. I don't want to take that bird dish. Alright, not a bad come up. I didn't get to kill the PDR fighter. I was chasing him for fucking five minutes. But um, homie got away. Homie was a little too fast. It is what it is. Alright, I guess we could call it a day. It wasn't bad games. We leveled up our fighter. We gotta start leveling other classes. And we made a good amount of profit. So far, so good. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video. It's Timo, and I'll see you in a dungeon. Peace out.